Uh, it's too bad it didn't work out better. I've got on the yeah, other end yeah. of the spectrum, the you and Destiny before you came on our show were kind of rivals. And yes. then my uh, impression is that once you got to talk to them, you know, outside of like a debate format, that you two yeah. got along much better than you expected. That sounds yeah, right? that was great. I noticed that uh, I noticed that Chiz got a lot of shit from your ungrateful subredditors too about that pairing. <laughs> And Our I, subreddit? No. They're your fantastic. subreddit. The, I cannot believe that any of those people think they could do a better job than Chiz. I saw them calling him Chizrag over and over, which is very disrespectful. They should be ashamed of themselves. <laughs> he put Chiz. It takes balls to tell me and Destiny to get together on the same show. None of them would ever tell me that to my face, and they're lying. If they say they would, they would tuck their dicks between their legs and <laughs> slink home to mommy. And Chiz earns that 5%, you motherfuckers. Um, <laughs> no, I, I think Destiny's, I think Destiny's, a, funny, Destiny's a funny guy. Uh, I think he's doing a lot of weird shit with his relationship. Talking about politics with him makes me instantly an atom bomb laying motherfucker. He's really mother good at it. What, what, what do you mean? Uh, He's not good at it. You only I, think I know. Because you agree with him. What do you mean? No, no, no. I disagreed with him. <laughs> I was right. And You're he still won. No, keep, keep arguing. Keep arguing. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, no. no. This, yeah, yeah. So, this, so you don't know that this one what? episode, I keep bringing it up. He was saying that it is through no fault of uh, people who aren't thriving in society, like bigger groups, yeah. say, uh, urban areas or what have you, <laughs> that it wasn't yeah. their fault. And then he yeah. pinned it to their grandparents and great-grandparents eating paint chips, what I thought was the most ridiculous horseshit in the world. But yeah. through superior debating skills, I think he came out on top. And that is the, that's why I think he's good at it. He could argue that the sky's not blue, it seems, and still beat me. <laughs> and, I mean, you can argue some and still be wrong. <laughs> oh, I, yeah. oh, he's the wrong. Sky is blue. He's, he's yeah. got to be wrong. I'm sticking to that. He's crazy wrong. But I feel yeah. like he outperformed in the debate. And that's why I say he's good at it. You know I what? liked having Dick and Destiny on the show because immediately it became apparent that it's like, Okay, obviously both of these people are intelligent human beings who know PKA is not the place to air your dirty, dirty laundry. It's the place to be a silly bitch and make jokes about things. And obviously Destin knew that. Dick knows that. Like That's why that episode went so well is because it was like, who gives a fuck about yeah. little political disagreements? Let's just joke around. And, and once, well, once they were next to each other in a non-political conversation, they got along. That's what I, I, so Dick, do you tell me, am I on target with that? Am I off target? No, I don't think you're off target. Uh, Wired, Wired interviewed me for some, I think it was a hit piece that they were writing on Destiny. Um, oh. the, guy, the guy interviewed me for like an hour. It was, right, it was sometime after your show. Um, he interviewed me for an hour. He didn't use a goddamn thing I said in the interview. Uh, and it was, but he led the article with it where he was calling me a stupid jock asshole or whatever. Um, but, but it was when a I, hit on Destiny, you thought? Yeah, I think it was a hit on both of us. Uh, it was okay. mostly focused on him. I think it was a takedown of him because, like, Destiny is – Destiny and I are, are the same in the way that uh, we're kind of a purist, I guess I want to say, um, and that causes a lot of problems in our, in our spheres. Uh, like, all of his – a lot of his left-wing guys – like, a lot of his left-wing guys turn on him because he thinks it's cool to say the N-word, uh, and he has, looks down upon them and, and is full of disdain for any person who thinks that saying the N word is inherently wrong. Uh, and I, I a hundred percent agree with him and think it's fucking insane that people, that people act like it's a magical word and somehow is, uh, somehow has any power and that like, that's not what gives it its power. Uh, but I, I think he yes, said the N word was cool. <laughs> he says it a lot. I think, I think that's what's I take the happened. coward's path on that issue. <laughs> no, I've he, seen he brother. says it a lot. Really, <laughs> I've seen him defend it to a black person. Yeah, I've seen a black person be like, you know, you say this a lot, and he's just like, yeah, I do. Dude, the respect to destiny on that. That's exactly. hilarious. That's exactly. hilarious. That's he's just like, out. yeah, you can't tell me what not to say, bitch. Is that basically what he's saying? No, he said you can't tell me what to say, N word. <laughs> <That's true. laughs> it's like you know look look i i if you're calling someone that with hate in your heart yeah that's fucked up there's a lot of words that i think are fucked up like that that one seems to be the one that gets the most um that hurts people the most which is what i think maybe gives it the power but yeah. as a harry potter fan i'm gonna tell you 
Yeah. When we start referring to Voldemort as he who must not be named, we give him a lot of power. Mm. Power yeah. to evil. We should really. just call Voldemort the N word. <laughs> <laughs> that's the lesson of the day. That's the, that's the fucking lesson of the day, my friends. Call Voldemort the N word. I mean, I've always thought I could put a lot more venom into a good sir than even the most hateful racist could. <laughs> Like if you want to compare how much hatred is in your heart, you stack me up against David Duke with a and put give us a bad server, and I'll give him a sir that'll turn him white. Um, <laughs> photos of that guy David Duke. What the fuck is going on with his eyebrows? Regrow them. They're gone. Hey, you know Taylor, I don't like you taking down people whose eyebrows seem to be. Uh, if you have a receding eyebrow line. That's not necessarily your fault. I do admit I'm a bit of an eyebrow supremacist. Woody is becoming <laughs> less and less expressive every day. <laughs> and that's, Dude, and that's why I'm eyebrows. booting they only go uh, David halfway. Duke. That's <laughs> 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 just what I look like. <laughs> it's like a lazy cartoon character. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, In real do. life, they're there. Like, there's, they're just, I don't know. Are they graying? I'll have to look, but. You got to darken them ships up, dude. I, I don't darken anything. I just. You do have gray. You've got some gray in there now, the man. The beard in particular is super gray. My hair is not that gray. It is by my ears. But uh No, and Woody's beard is fucking fantastic. <laughs> and we try and convince him to keep it going because Woody looks badass with a beard. And always he'll grow a fucking fantastic beard where he's looking <laughs> hardcore as fuck. And then I'll show up the next day and be like, Well, yeah, Jackie didn't like it. And I'm like, No! No, no, no. Make I can, her like I can it. tell if Woody and Jackie are being romantic at that time of the month just <laughs> by his facial hair. <laughs> I feel like maybe there's a week every month it's, where Woody's like... It's not it always a good... We, we were romantic just recently, and uh, <laughs> all the kisses were on the neck, to be honest with you, because she's not a fan. Well, and Woody, like, you... You wear the beard so well, it's <laughs> I don't even frustrating. Think that's true. I think it's it looks better on camera than real when life. When you're like, oh, well, well I, I should get rid of it. And it's like, no, it looks great. <laughs> it's fantastic. I love the Woody beard. I wish it would stick around more. And Jackie, can you kind of get on our team here? Come on. <laughs> can, can you kind of get on the same team with us? You know? Fans, don't you know come on my Twitch and hate on Jackie because <laughs> of this. It's not nice. <laughs> Uh, no, it, yeah, you do you're, like, you're, a, like a goatee and just shave the cheeks and then give her a nuzzle over there. But keep, can you do like a lemmy from I, Motorhead? I could do the opposite. Thing. <laughs> a lemmy I from could Motorhead. keep the cheeks and Button remove chops. the goatee. Uh, yeah, yeah. Just the chops. Or maybe uh, one of those flavor savers that, that's like <laughs> a little soul patch. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Like, like Doc Antle has in the Tiger King. This is this, this one of those. Is that what he has? Dude, that, that guy so. is apparently doing podcasts all over the place right now. All Doc of them Antle. are. We got to get Doc Antle on the show. That would be sick. I would love to talk to that fucking sociopath. I, I've oh, been yeah. talking more to Chiz lately. I gave him a small list. Yeah, he wasn't on it. He should be. But uh, I'm looking forward to some of the people we can get. Nice. Yeah, awesome. man. Yeah. I'm glad all four of you are still together, by the way. I was kind of worried cruising your subreddit about some of the shit that was going on there. Our subreddit is uh, excited bunch of guys. <laughs> <laughs> they make some we really all... funny memes, though, man. <laughs> they, they, uh... <laughs> we all get along pretty, pretty fucking well in real life, you know? I, 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 yeah, we do. I, it, like, it, it is I, funny I, I when like... Like, people will be like, oh, I... There's gonna be a huge explosion between Woody Taylor and Kyle, and then like seeing that post, and then that day when we signed up to PKN, like signed in, it was like, "Hey, what's up, guys?" And, oh, yeah, everything's going good. Yeah, yeah the whole thing happened. Off. Sorry about that. I really, yeah, 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 no big yeah. deal. You know, yeah, it's whatever. I had people in my stream being like, "So are you never gonna talk to Woody or Kyle again?" And I was like, "No, no, are you retarded?" Like, yes, the some answer, of them yeah. might be. Yes, yeah, some of them might be. You, uh, My mom did the typing not. for me. <laughs> yeah. My mom did the typing for me. Yeah. I can promise That's you I will accent. never go on your subreddit <laughs> and leave a uh, seven, point, uh, seven points of light list about what's wrong with your show. That I can promise <laughs> 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 I, like, yes, I would never do that to you. I would never go all over your subreddit. I need you. bullet points, goddammit. <laughs> if you're writing it in full paragraphs, not reading. <laughs> bullet points. I, I, I expect a PowerPoint presentation. Mm. Yeah. <laughs> 
I'll make a TikTok. The last time there was a PowerPoint flow chart. on the show is when Woody made that hilarious fucking conspiracy thing where you and Woody, you you don't give yourself enough credit for how funny it was. And you like <laughs> had your slide up and you would say, and this happened, and here's why. Next slide. <laughs> the, the next slide bit got me so hard. <laughs> Back and to the left. Back and to the left. I wasn't prepared for any questions in my thin knowledge on the topic. <laughs> yeah, we this is what happened. Next, let's move on. Don't Dude, ask we need about to do it. conspiracy shit more often because I just found out that my conspiracy about the Denver airport airport okay has like eight hundred thousand views on youtube oh did someone upload this oh, highlight yeah they uploaded just all of our conspiracy bits and just the denver airport retardation one got huge how, how much does my holocaust denial bit have? <laughs> I, I don't know that was also very you. funny because you you earnestly presented it the whole time where you'd be like next thing wooden doors how's that keep it in Next thing, like, <laughs> you, you just went through the whole fucking gamut. That was hilarious. Because it was like, well, shit, some of this is indisputable, all right? I believe a Holocaust happened, but I think their numbers may be a little skewed. <laughs> Which no is odd coming knowing. from a people who count so well. <laughs> who, who counts so good. Yeah. Oh, yeah. I was I like, why do German it. people count? Oh, uh, <laughs> I get it. Because they were fucking with Jews, I see. Yeah. 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 <laughs> so, yeah that shit was bankers. hilarious. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs>